Riddle does this, what happens with the Riddler in the second season? Uh, well, you know, we've left off, we finished season one with this kind of schizophrenic psychosis, uh, you know, explosion that he had. Um, and that is essentially the response of someone who is so frustrated with himself, with other people, um, with his life. Uh, he's just a complete loser. Nothing goes his way. And he's angry. Um, and he exploded. And so season two, we're kind of starting from that place. Uh, you know, he has this other voice in his head that is encouraging him to just do something, take ownership of his life, make decisions. Um, and this voice is going to manifest itself into, uh, you know, another version of him that he has to confront. Whether that is um, someone he wants to become or not, I don't know. Uh, you know, he has to decide that. But he's going to start harnessing confidence, you know, just trying things. Be direct with Kristen Kringle. Just like, be, be a man. Don't ask her on a date, tell her that you're taking her out, you know? Uh, so that's, that's kind of what you're going to see. Um, and you're, you're going to see someone who's desperate to find a new identity. And that's the beginning of a, a, a quest, you know, that will eventually take us to the river. It's, a way, it's, it's still a ways off. But, you know, anyone who is searching for a better self, uh, you know, are going to find themselves in some trouble. Okay, sorry guys, that's all. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you got him in here, that was great.